with cold weather on the way, maybe you're looking to fly out somewhere. But what happens if you haven't flown out of an airport for some time? Well, there are big changes you should know about, including here at these doors. One of the first things people are going to see that might be a little bit different if they haven't traveled in a while is that only passengers and employees are allowed inside the terminal. So if you're dropping somebody off or even picking someone up, you won't be able to go inside with them, except under certain uh, circumstances. We do have exceptions if there are minors or someone with mobility issues. And you do still need to have a test if you're flying. The, the rules are slightly different for land border. But what we do recommend for anybody is to check on our website. We've got a lot of information. You can plug in your destination and and it'll tell you what the requirement is to enter that country, and that includes the U.S. Yeah, we do have testing available. It's just at our parking garage. It's open at 4 a.m. and closes at 11. So if you're looking for a way to get your test done ahead of time, uh, you can have it on the day of if you leave yourself enough time. But one of the cool things that we've got, placed around the airport, you're going to find these clean slate device, Canadian company. So what can you do? You've got a cell phone, your tablet, anything like that, anything that's got a hard surface, you put it in, and it's going to sanitize your device. We've been using UV light in some really creative ways, so we've got it also in our escalators, moving walkways. We've taken some steps to make sure that our passengers are feeling safe. That has included giving them contactless ordering options for food and beverages. Hop onto Uber Eats, you can tell it where you are in the airport, what location that you're at, and it's gonna tell you what restaurants are available. You can place your order and it'll be delivered to you. So they're duty free, what we've done is you can actually place your order online and then pick it up when you get to the airport. When people are traveling now, we are advising them to leave themselves lots of time to come. So when, if you're flying domestically within Canada, we're advising about 90 minutes ahead of time. If you're traveling internationally, that can be three hours. For more on what you can expect here at Toronto Pearson International Airport, visit our website, toronto.citynews.ca. For City News, I'm Nick Westall.